This is my third. Yes, hi. Third year riding. And you have a personal connection to MS. Yes, I do. My first cousin, Lori Myers, uh, has MS. In fact, she spoke at one of our team meetings uh, last year and how the fundraising that we're doing and the drugs that they're uh, developing through the fundraising has helped her impact. She gets a shot every month and she talked about that and how uh, grateful she is to the fundraising that we're doing. So, yeah, I, you know, it's a personal connection for me. You've been one of the top fundraisers every year also, haven't you? Yes, I, you know, enjoy doing it and so... Uh, Hi, like I'm my people! So, yes. What's happening? Thank you. Hi, yeah. Hi, I'm Sonny Andrade from Univision Network, Premier Impact. I'm very happy to be here in the MS bike ride. It's my first time. I hope to uh, make uh, 200 miles. Let's see. <laughs> but, you know, we're here happy with the MAC team, the uh, MAC cycle team. Come here. This is Jojo Russo. Jojo Russo is our number one top female. Woo! fundraiser in the 2013 MS Bike Ride. We love JoJo because she is truly somebody who gives back to the community in a big, big way. But JoJo, how did you raise so much money? Uh, I have, I'm hosting uh, dinner at my house and offices, Vietnamese cuisine. And anybody come donate $25. And you don't get good Vietnamese food in Miami, you come to my house. So it's a bargain. She yes. has gourmet Vietnamese meals, yes. $25 a head, and at this point she's over $3,000 in fundraising. So thank you, Jojo, for uh, all you do. You're welcome. I'm glad to join my cycle team. Thank you. Great outfit. See? Great outfit. Woo! Yeah. <laughs> we'll have a great ride. Okay, okay. good. Thanks, Jojo. Uh, you're welcome. <laughs>
Yeah, see, this is a little bit better. I was defeating myself. I kept saying, oh my god, I didn't get enough sleep. I didn't, you know, I was complaining. Like, I didn't get enough sleep? No. Ooh. <laughs> what? Okay, I'm going to stop Hi, everybody. This is Moyes Bruce, our fabulous Max Cycling Team fitness member. And we'll see shortly, Moyes is a triple amputee and did the 53.3 miles today on the MS bike ride. So, Moyes, I'm going to ask you a couple questions here. Sure, First of all, what was the toughest part of this ride for you? Um, the toughest part for me was the first 10 miles. Like, I think once I got the first 10 miles behind me, it was smooth sailing after that. Smooth sailing. The, the, the other 43.3 was smooth sailing. Yeah, it wasn't as bad as I expected. Um, honestly, I, I, I feel like the last ride I did, which was uh, 32 miles, was nothing compared to this. This one was much more easier. But also, I would like to say I'm in better shape than I was. So maybe so that has something. You did some training. So do you have training tips for uh, people that want to do this MS bike ride next year? Stay in a group. <laughs> and now, group. let people know why you should, you should stay in a group. Well, today was the wind was sort of bad, but not too bad. But for me, at least, like when, when I'm behind somebody, I'm able to keep a much a much higher average speed than when I'm by myself fighting the wind by myself. So it's sort of like you just trap behind a group and sometimes you guys switch places up in the front and carry the load. And it makes it a lot, lot, much, much more easier than riding by yourself. Do you plan on riding again next year in this place? Oh yeah, definitely. Next year I might do the 80. 80, okay. So um, what's, uh, what's so cool about being on the next cycling fitness team? All the, all the other... Me, that's the cool part. Oh, me, that's the now cool part. Now we're going to have to edit. We're going to have to edit. That's Mary Jane Mark, owner of Max Cycling Fitness. And uh, yes, because of Mary Jane, we get to do this ride. I get to do this ride. Moise gets to do this ride. We have 180 plus people on the Max Cycling Fitness team this year. And we plan on raising because of your efforts and our 181 team member efforts. We plan on raising well over $100,000 again this year. So thank you, boys. No problem. Anything for a good cause. So when you first started riding, when we first met, you had a goal. Yeah, that is to uh, to break some world records in 2016 Paralympic cycling. Um, at first, it was just to make it, but now it's really to break to break some records. Because I feel like I can really do it, and it's really up in here. You know, if you set a goal and you work hard towards it, anything is possible. You've been accepted into a, a specific training camp. Yes, and that that is the first step. And I, I'm the youngest one there, and uh, they're just gonna go crazy over me because hopefully I will be one of the ones to replace the I don't want to say older members. Right. Well, older members. So it's a really good opportunity for me. Is there anything people can do to help you in your in your goals? Um, well, right now I feel like I have pretty much everything that I need. Um, I don't really need much now. Um, I think the next step for me is to just go up there and uh, hopefully more things will come. When is that training camp? May 1st. May 1st. Like next month. Coming up. Hopefully where? I don't get out the two tickets. Where, where is it? Colorado Springs. Colorado Springs. Springs. No, Olympic Training there. Center. It's not visible. Oh, yeah, I forgot. It's like, I don't know. It's pretty tall. It's How many other high. athletes will be there? Um, well, this one is sort of like a mix. So probably, it's only probably going to be like 15 people. Excellent. Um, the coaches that are going to train you. Yeah, right? like the, the coaches that actually work with the A team. Actually, I'm probably going to make the B team this year. The A team is a little harder to make. But, um, yeah. It's pretty exciting. It is. Okay, uh, words to your fans out there. Yeah, we're having a Words to your fans out there. Thank you. Thank you. Very cool. Like fans like that out there, right? I love that. Thank you. Words to your fans and uh, the recipients of the money that you raised. Just never give up. Never give up, no matter what happens, you know? Like, I was, unfortunately, I was in a really bad motorcycle accident where I lost three limbs. But I mean, you know, like, life continues. Just never give up. Awesome. Thank you, Mike. Awesome. Thank you. No, you want to. Thank you. How did your new work today? I took it off. You did take it off. Also, stay far, we give you a good night.
Is it where we get the bike? Because it was uncomfortable no. for you, or you just weren't used to riding with it? Um, I had it for like. Yeah. I think I got it on Thursday. Uh, so, so, you have yeah, so I just, I mean, really, it will work really well, like when I'm climbing, because I'll get to like use different muscles when I'm up there. Right. But I think when, you know, flats, I just in my little arrow position. Did you see arrow? Yeah. Let's get some crow. Yeah. Larry! Turn around.